What is going on, guys? What is up? What is up? It's Miguel Fuentes coming back at you once again. Welcome back. Welcome in. Whew. Guys, I hope you had an amazing, amazing new year. I hope that it was everything that you wanted it to be. You had a good time, took some time off, rested, relaxed, and are now up and ready to roll for 2018 because today's the first day. Today is the first day of the rest of the year, the day that that really is going to define how the rest of your year goes as long as as you commit to it. And I've got some awesome tips for you guys to really move forward in your business, to really start getting more success for 2018. Some tips to ensure, hey, what's going on, Corey? How are you? Some tips to help you achieve that level of total badassery. Danny, what's up, buddy? How are you? That total badassery that you need for your 2018 to just absolutely explode. Ah. Oh. Okay, guys, let's get into this. Let's get into this. Uh, First things first. The first thing that we're going to do, and uh, you may not like this one, but it's an absolute necessary evil. And guys, by the way, my computer's been having a little bit of an issue maintaining the connection. So if it drops, I'm not, I didn't jump off or anything. It just, it just is doing that right now. And if the audio sounds funky, definitely let me know. So that way I can uh, adjust it or do what I need to do. Anyway, first things first plan. I hate that word. Does it, nobody likes that word. It's boring. It's not sexy. It's not fun. Nobody likes to sit down and write things. Guys, planning. Planning is absolutely huge and absolutely necessary if you're going to create some massive badassery in 2018. I absolutely believe that if you have a plan for where you're going, What are you going to create? Don't just say to yourself, I'm going to have a six figure income and that's it. Like that's, that's, that's the goal, right? That's, I'm going to be this huge personality, whatever. No, take some time. If that's your ultimate goal in 2018, if your ultimate goal, whatever it is, if it's a money goal, if it's a health goal, financial goals, whatever, whatever it is you're working on, take that goal, grab it, look at it. And then start to look inside it, peel it apart, look and see what it's made of, what's inside of that goal. Know and understand within yourself where exactly you're going to land this year. Where are you going to end up? Where is the exact place that you want to end up at the end of this year, at the end of 2018, maybe before? Set a very specific goal, give it a date. So pick a date. If you want to be out of your job by August like me, then great. If you want to be, you know, hitting your next rank in a month, then awesome. Look at it. Be very real with yourself. Look at it and then start to plan it in reverse order. Say to yourself, okay, I know to hit the next rank in my company, in my business, it's going to take this many people. So I know that I've got to sign up X number of people before that date. Great. That's awesome. That's a great place to start. Now you know. You need X number of people before this day, and that's when you're going to hit your next rank. But now let's take it a step further. What is your closing conversion? Like how how fast can you close in your business? What's it generally like? And it's known. I know a lot of multi-level companies, they already have that statistic down. It's like 1 of 10 or 2 of 10, 3 of 10. And the folks that are very, very good, they're like seven of 10, whatever. Just being very, hey, Angela, how's it going? Just being very real. If it's like one of 10, you need to sign up three people to hit your next rank. You got to talk to 30 people in order to do that. And you look at that far away goal and you say to yourself, okay, I need to be getting one sign up a week before that date, every week, one sign up a week to be able to hit that goal that's way down the road. I need to be able to be talking to 20 to 30 people a day in order to actually hit that goal. What is it? What's your rate? I don't know what your statistic is that's going to get you there, but I know that if you take that goal, that high ideal, and you start to break it down into the little pieces, what you're going to end up with is a solid plan of action that goes from A to Z in a very simple and easy way to understand. It's just simply the movement from here to there, here's the action steps. Guys, it will make so much difference in how much you're gonna execute because you can take out that plan and be like, I didn't talk to 20, I didn't talk to enough people today. 
I need to go talk to more people. I didn't make enough phone calls today. I'm off track. You can have a very, very clear picture in your mind of where you're going to land, how much effort you need to put in. Because in my opinion, that is, is one of the biggest and most misconceived things about this industry period is the level of effort it's going to take for you to actually win in your business. And I'll promise you, that leads me to my next point. That leads me to my next point. Guys, January 1st, 2018 is officially a holiday. It is a holiday. Banks are closed. Probably only 7-Eleven is open. Who knows? It's a holiday. But I got to tell you, today is the day one. Never, ever, ever. And Tony Robbins says this all the time. It's one of his sayings that sticks with me and I live by it. Whenever you make a decision to go big, whenever you make a decision to, to really step up your game, never leave the scene of that decision without taking action towards achieving it, without setting yourself into the process of achieving it. However small, however great that is, take some action towards it. And that makes it real. That starts to bring it into the real reality and it starts to exist more. And that's, and guys, most of the time, in, in this industry, it's really misunderstood how much work is actually involved. How much time do you have to do that? But if you do exactly what we just talked about, you sit down with yourself, you say, here's my goal and I wanna have it by this day and here's the numbers that are all deconstructed and written down. I need to talk to this many people every single day to hit that goal. If you do that, when you take your action, you can go beyond it. You can say, instead of talking to 10 people today, I talked to 15, I'm ahead of the game. Instead of talking to 20 people today, I talked to 30 people today, I'm ahead of the game. I'm way ahead of the game. I'm moving forward, I'm crushing it, I'm going for it. Guys, and there's nothing more motivational, in my opinion, in, I, I, I think this is absolutely true for a lot of people, but when you are taking action in your business and in your life, whew, people can see it. They can sense it, they can smell it, they can feel it. Nothing breeds action like more action. When you start taking that massive action, you get into that mode, you get into that movement of going forward in your business. Nothing starts turning those wheels faster than taking more action. And before you know it, the sucker's just moving all on its own, just barreling down the highway and cannot be stopped. So guys, Take some action today, January 1st. I know it's crazy. Um, I saw a post earlier today. Uh, someone officially had worked out for every single day this year, but it's only January 1st, so officially that's the truth. It's awesome. <laughs> Guys, and I want to encourage you, okay? It's a long year. It really is, 365 days. Do this one at a time, okay? Do it one at a time. You win a little bit every single day. You win in steps every single day. You take the actions you need to take. You follow your plan. You execute it. Don't get distracted and just start to create consistency. Start to create massive consistency. Focus on setting your life in the right direction for you to win. Now, I love that. I, I say this all the time and I say it because it's absolutely true. Being an entrepreneur is not a part-time thing. It's not something you can do on the side and, and expect to get the results that you want if you want to go big. If you really want to go big, you've got to structure your life around it. You have to be able to structure your time. You have to be able to structure your life to be able to have that time to focus, to have that time to be consistent, to make a commitment on the highest level that this is what you're going to do. Therefore, you structure your world on around doing that. And believe me, when you make that decision, the time will just show up. The time will just be there. The time will be there for you. You'll be able to execute and be consistent, which guys, this is 365 days. I don't know what your goals are when you plan to hit them, but if you can structure everything else around what you're doing, it will absolutely pay off in the end. And it will seem like less work because you'll know exactly how much you have to do. 
Anyway, guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. I absolutely appreciate you all. Danny, for, Danny, welcome. Jacqueline, Angela, right on, right on. Guys, much love. Take care. If you got value from this, make sure you like, comment, and share as always. And if you'd love to get a hand or just, just a little advice on what's going on in your world, shoot me a message. I'd love to chat with you. Much love. Bye for now, guys. Take care. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, guys. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm rocking this thing out this year, guys. I'm watching you guys. I'm going to see. I want to see. Let's, let's really stay consistent this year. We can do this. I believe in you. Much love. Bye for now, guys.